current estimate in the U.S. puts the number of dead at over 10 million. But this is many would consider a wildly conservative estimate. Regarding the entire world, I, I can't even begin to give you a number. It's been confirmed from several sources that the destruction of Shanghai and Hong Kong were the result of thermonuclear explosions. Whether set by the Chinese government, a rogue faction of the Chinese military, or the Russian government and their promise to aggressively defend their borders is still not and may never be known. Please be advised, we are transmitting this message with very low power. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Australian Defence Force. The American virus K17PXVI is spreading rapidly within Australia, with cases being reported in every state. Residents in Queensland and New South Wales are advised to take extra precautions, as the highest concentration of cases are in those areas. K17PXVI is highly volatile and contagious, and it has the ability to suppress a host. My name is Harold, and I'm, and I'm with my friend, his sister, my wife, and we, and we are safely held in a bunker. If anyone can read this, please contact us, please. Carefully, you do have the cure. I will repeat myself like I repeated myself last night. We have the cure. Our location's not too far away from you. Our communications might be cut, so please. John, we seriously need to discuss this. Discuss what? There's nothing to talk about. Really, John? Because I beg to differ. They've been repeating that message ever since we heard it last night. You know how many messages I got like that? Plenty of people have said they found the cure. And all I can do is be left disappointed. This one's different, John, and you know it. If they really say they have the cure, then we need to get there as soon as possible. She might not have much longer. And I need to know that you're with me 100% on this. Listen, Harold. I know you're still holding on to hope, but... I just don't want to be disappointed again. We've been let down so many times, it's hard to count. If we do go through with this, I don't want it to be for nothing. It wouldn't be for nothing because we'd be saving her life. Your sister doesn't have much time left, so think about that. Isabel?
Isabel. I don't know if you're awake or if you can hear me, but we might. We might be able to help you. And I don't care what your brother says, I'm gonna do everything in my power to help you. I will do everything I can. Harold, don't push yourself, please, not for me. I need you to look after my brother if anything happens to me, all right? I'm doing this for us, Isabel. You can't just give up like that. Not, not, not on me. If you're not doing this for yourself, do it for me, please. I can't live without you. You or your brother, John. You're all I have left. Harold, you are capable of doing many things. If I pass... You listen to me, Isabel. I will not lose you. I will not. I will get you that medicine. I will. Even if I gotta do it by myself. Harold. Please. Please just be careful. You know I love you, honey. to their spot. You can either come with me or you can stay here and watch over your sister. Either way, I'm getting her that medicine and the cure. If Look, I know there's no convincing you. So that's why I made the decision myself to go with you. Hey, would you look at that? Big bro stepping up for his sister. <laughs> I knew you'd come around. Now look, last night I already filled the car up with gas. It doesn't have much in it, but maybe we can find something out there, whatever is left. We should get going pretty soon. It will get dark quick. Listen, Harold. You know that once we do this, there's no going back. I know. But right now, she's all that matters. All right. Pick her poison. Let's figure out what we're going to bring. I just need you to know that whatever happens, I'm right there with you to the end. No matter what happens to my sister, no matter what happens to me. I know. You all right? Yeah. I know I don't pray that much to you. But Lord, you know how much she means to me. You know how much John means to me. And God, I'm not the best at prayer, and I know I don't talk to you that often. 
I pray that you just keep me, my friend, and my wife safe. I pray that we find what we need, possibly more. Please be with us. I pray this in your holy name. That's strange. Last time we came through here, the place was scattered with runners. It's almost too quiet. I don't like it one bit. All right. We should move forward on foot. See if we can find gas. Leave it here. And then we'll look for the spot. Harold, what about scavengers? Do you think it's possible that they could have come this way? We'll just have to keep a close eye out. I mean, that's why we brought the guns we did, right? It's just that, well, I remember the last time I came here, I saw someone that looked like a scavenger and it was swarming with runners. And now all of a sudden they're just gone? That doesn't seem right. Well, look, if you're so scared about scavengers, maybe you should wait in the car. I got this, all right? No, no. I'll be all right. There we go. Now, come on. Let's get going. Make sure to keep your eyes peeled. There could be anyone or anything. For point of reference, Harold, I was just warning you about the last time I came down to this area. Also, when was the last time you saw a runner? Honestly, I have no clue. I mean, runners, they're pretty common, but I haven't seen one in almost like too much wait shh. i think i see one yeah i see one we got infected looks like he's by himself oh, wait he hit behind he hit behind the okay there he is you see him looks like he's alone but we should take him Yes. All right. We need to decide right now how we're gonna do this. We're gonna take him out stealthy. We're gonna stealthy. Yeah. Stealthy. Yeah. 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 That's right. Call. Okay. I'll take care of this. John, he's taken care of. John, Johnny, oh, they're right there. All right, let's get this gas and get a move. Shit, take cover! All right, John, I have a plan. Here's what I'm gonna do. Just, just rapidly, rapidly fire, all right? I'm gonna go over there and surprise him. It's possible there may be another guy. So I want you to stay here and just keep shooting, all right? Let's go! I'll distract them! Is that all you got? John, I got him! Harold, you alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. 
Well, that was close. Nearly shot off my head. But thank you. We'll just be happy I didn't. And by the way, do you think that was all of them? I don't know, but we definitely need to keep a close eye on. There could be more of them. Well, at least we took out what was, was here. Let's bring this gas back to the car. Let's be on our way. Not gonna lie, I was really kind of hoping for more. Yes, John, I know there's not that much, but we still have to try. John, we have a bigger problem. We're not gonna be able to take this car anywhere. Wait, what? Why? One of those guys, or maybe someone else, slashed one of our tires. Looks like we're moving on foot. Is it another scavenger? I don't know, but I swear I saw something. It was just a deer. It took off before I can get a clear shot. Man, I'm fucking starving. Well, there's a blockade over there. So maybe we can catch it in time before it gets too far. It took off. We're not going to be able to catch it in time. You know how fast those fuckers are? And plus, I'm no hunter, and neither are you. So let's just keep on moving. John! John, behind you! Hold on, John! I got you. Are you alright? What the fucker grabbed a hold of my hand? Waiting a little, but I don't think he bit me. Are you sure? It looks pretty bad. Yeah, I'm fine. Let's just get a move on. Also, my rifle is out of here. <sighs> Alright. Alright, then take my gun. Here. Right. And keep it with you, alright? Hey, Harold. What if it turns out I am, but what do we do then? If you say you're not infected, I believe you. Come on, let's keep going. It's bulletproof glass. Shit. And I don't think the doors are gonna be unlocked. So whatever's in this truck didn't want us to get in. Do you think there's anything inside worth taking? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Not like we can get to it. another one. I think it's a runner. As long as we stay out of its peripheral vision, I think we're okay. We got a runner! Keep shooting, I'm gonna go around! Make sure to double tap it. Yeah, I know. You all right, John? That thing knocked you pretty hard. Yeah, I'll be fine. All right then, and just keep. God, I feel like I've said the same thing twenty times. John, are you sure you're okay? You don't look so great.
I don't know, man. I'm starting to sweat a lot. And maybe it was just a tumble I took a second ago. But I feel like I'm getting sick. All right, all right. I just... Okay, let me think for a second. Okay, well, we're not too far away from the checkpoint. So I'll just keep a close eye on you. Let me know if it gets worse, all right? Ah, oh, shit, nothing in here. John, what was that? Did you see something? Everything's fine. I just saw a slow one. Nothing to worry about. All right, that's good. I... Hey, um, I'm sorry, but I, I couldn't find any medicine. You still feel pretty weak? Yeah, I'm not feeling too good. Yeah, don't worry, we'll find something for you out here. I mean, there's plenty of crates. I'm sure there's gotta have something. Hey, look, Harold. Just in case anything happens to me, I need... I need you to do something for me, all right? No, no, we're not having this conversation. You're gonna be okay, all right? We're gonna get to that... We're gonna reach that checkpoint, and we're gonna find the base, and we're gonna get that cure that they supposedly have. We're gonna get medicine. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna make... We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna pull through. We're gonna make it. All right? So I don't want to hear you worrying about it, all right? You said you were fine. You're, you're fine, all right? I'm gonna go up in the truck and see if I can find anything. All right, I see the checkpoint. We're not too far away from it. Just a few more. What the hell? John! John! There's two runners. They're coming. We got we got to get to that checkpoint. Now. We got to move. Come on. Come on, John. We're almost there. Take this, you bad dead fucks! John! What? John, come on! Hell, I'm out of ammo! Don't worry about it, come on! Oh my god, the checkpoint! They're all dead! They're all dead! Shit! Um, okay, uh, boom, boom, uh, boom. I, uh, I don't have any. Can you boost me over the fence? Come on. Okay, John, you're next. Come on, come on, come on. I'll help you up. John. Come on, they're coming! I'm sorry, Harold. But I'm not moving. John, please! No, please don't do this! John, please! Please! Your sister! What about her? Huh? Take care of Isabel for me, alright? I can't do this without you, my friend. Please. John! John, please try! John! I got no way. Where do I go? Oh shit, where do I go? 
Seems like nothing. Even though I tell myself to give up countless times, and I keep replaying what you say over and over again, in my head is about. I know deep down you want me to keep on going, Jonathan, and that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna find the cure. I'm gonna get to that base and find it for Isabel, no matter the cost. I just wish you were here with me, because I don't know how I can do it alone. I know you're right beside me, but it's so hard to picture it. It's been days. And I'm still pushing through. I keep replaying this Bible verse that I heard. For I consider that the suffering of this present time are not worth comparing with the glory that is to be revealed to us. I did it. 